Jameis Winston moments ago. We ain't leaving without a victory. We ain't leaving without a victory. Y'all, hey, my brother, that's how I want to be. That's how I Okay, the Florida State, if we gonna do it then, we do it then. Let's go. Out to the right. Taj Boyd on first down looks underneath. And that was down on the ground. The ball was fumbled near the first down marker on right our opening play from scrimmage here. I think that ball And it was recovered by yeah. Florida State. Second year was the receiver on the play, the tight end. Amos Winston comes into this game with a lot of bravado, a lot of confidence, second in nation and passing efficiency. The best thing you could say about him replacing a first round pick in EJ Manuel is he's protecting the football. He's only thrown two interceptions in the entire year. Martin Jenkins, the nickelback, checks into the game for the Tigers. The communication, a challenge here for the Knowles for the first time all year in Death Valley. Winston goes up in the air, reaching for it is Benjamin. Touchdown Knowles. What a grab by Kelvin Benjamin. Goes up in the air. What great body control and ball skills there, Brent. And to the throw from the pocket for a first down stands tall and hits Rashad Green pocket holes again strikes for a first down to Green for the second time tonight Winston fires O'Leary's first catch still moving he has 11 make it 12 catches this year and five for touchdowns and he picks up a first down. And when you have a great group of wide receivers, one thing that can complement that other than an awesome running back is a great tight end. How about the position of that football by Jameis Winston? Winston fires in underneath, and it is complete. Perfect. Indicated the zone, and Sammy Watkins stepped right into it. They're going to keep it in the air, and fumble, scooped up, into the end zone, Mario Edwards, scoop and score. First quarter, play action, Winston going to take off. Showing his athletic ability as he crosses midfield, and he's finally ridden out of bounds by Darius Robinson, one of the defensive backs. Looking down at eight, first play of the second quarter. Winston rolls the pocket to the right. That offensive line holds up as long as it could. And O'Leary with his second catch of the night, and he is across the 35-yard line before Sui makes the stop. From the end zone. Fires complete to Green for a first down. Rashad Green. Quick pitch to the outside. Shaw. And they've got another first down. They get to the edge that time against Robert Smith. First down. Keep it in the air. And Green this time breaks free. 35. Foot race. Great speed. Here goes Green. Touchdown, Florida State. And the signal to the crowd. He's trying to make a play. Great job of picking up the pressure. And once he made that safety miss, nobody's going to catch Rashad Green. Things come back in. Five minutes to go in the first half. Going deep down that far sideline. One on one. And trying to break Green through the penalty flag. The defender was holding on. Winston. Plenty of time, couldn't find an open receiver on the move. Chucks it beautifully to Green. Winston on first down, fires complete. Here's Green again, and Green picking up about nine yards.
fires. Caught first down. Benjamin breaks free, and he's into the red zone. The 16-yard line on a big third down strike. Drop it off underneath. Touchdown, Rashad Green. A little more prominent in the headlines than Javu. Here comes Winston firing now complete to O'Leary. Yeah. For the second consecutive year, Winston back firing complete. Here's O'Leary battling away. Side the 10. Powerful run for the young man from South Florida. Winston's got an open path. Touchdown, Florida State. Pops likes it. That's my boy. <laughs> some guys, all these years you've covered this, and I, I know for me, there's some guys that just you almost feel like they're born to do this. And, I, and, and Jameis Winston feels like that. He just feels like the bigger the stage, the better he's going to play. So he's down to the seven yard line. Freeman bounces off, spins, powerful run for a touchdown. Brought in a big offensive lineman there, Iron. From the end zone, lobs it out. O'Leary wide open. 40, midfield. 40, 35, 30, 20. 10 down at the 5. I'll tell you one thing, he's faster than Jack ever was. <laughs> Knocks down the field goal. 51 points here tonight. And 6 foot 4 inch Jameis Winston. Winston 22 of 34, 444 yards, 3 touchdowns and another rushing touchdown. And some fine defensive efforts in there. Herbie talked about Telvin Smith, LaMarcus Joyner. They were outstanding all night long. Jameis, congratulations on the win. All night long, people talking about how difficult it is to come into Death Valley and come away with a win. How did you play with such poise and confidence as such a young guy? Well, first of all, I just got to thank my Lord and Savior. But my team is so good. I'm so confident in my guys. And that man you just was talking to, I love him. I love him with all my heart. He called a great game. We played a great game. We were not scared. We came in confidence. And my offensive line blocked their tail off. My route receivers caught everything I threw. My running backs ran the ball. They played a great game. You played with so much poise and leadership. Before the game, you said you don't even know what the word nervous means when you're on the field. Where does that confidence come from? You always got confidence when you got a great team like that. We have, like, those guys are better. They've been there, done that. We knew that this was going to be a tough environment. But I told them, I said, guys, we're not worried about no noise because we're going to bring no noise. Well, guess what, Jameis? A conversation has started tonight. It started upstairs with Brent and Herbie. It's across the country that you are in the thick of the Heisman conversation. How do you respond to something like that just six games in? I got to thank my team. I got to thank my son. If it, wasn't because, if, it, if it wasn't for them, if it wasn't for Kenny Shaw, Rashad Green, Brian Stork, Cam Irvin, my whole team, Kevin Benjamin, if it wasn't for all those guys, Devontae Freeman, I mean, I could just keep naming. If it weren't for them, if it weren't for Coach Fisher giving me the opportunity, if it weren't for the man upstairs blessing me and blessing me with that team, it would not be there. Jameis, look at this. You've turned Death Valley into Tallahassee overnight. Well done. <laughs> hey, thank you. I'm trying to tell you, Florida State bringing that swag back. <laughs> Told you. He's the real deal, folks. They want to bring that swag back. There's no mistake years. about this young man. 51 14 is our final. It was all Florida State. So now it is time for the Ford wrap up, and what a day this has been in college football. We want to go to Robert Flores, and he'll tell you all about the shakeup. Indeed, it was shakeup Saturday. So long, everybody.